Hello and welcome to Mustaq Kunnur Academy. In this video, I will show you how to draw a schematic of RC coupled amplifier and how to draw its layout using dip trace software. As we can see that in this circuit, it consists of a transistor that is Q1 VC107 at input it is having two register as a voltage divider and it also has collector register and emitter and emitter register and emitter capacitor at output it is having one r and one c and vcc is connected as a power supply and a capacitor c1 is connected at the input this is the schematic once we draw its schematic its layout looks like this this is the top layer of this layout and this is the bottom layer of the layout now let's draw its schematic as well as layout using dip trace software in order to open the dip trace software just click on circuit launcher or launcher just double click on it once we double click click on schematic capture once we click on schematic capture First, we have to select the transistor. In order to select the transistor, just go to filter here and type BC107. Select all library and apply filter. It's searching. Once we select transistor, we have to select resistors as well as capacitor. Now BC107, just click on it and place here. We need total 6 resistors. For that, go to general non IPC and Select the register here and place it accordingly. We need two register at the input. Now, just rotate this register. Now rotate this register, press R, press R. Now we need capacitor, just again go to general non-IPC, go to cap, select here the capacitor here, one capacitor at the input, one capacitor at the output. Now make the connection between these two registers first. We also need a ground, for that go to net port and select here the ground. Now connected this to. We also need one more capacitor. We can copy paste this same one. Copy this and paste here. Just rotate this. Make the connection. Yeah, we're done with the connection. We also need a battery or power supply. For that, go to battery connector here. Go to battery holder. Select this as battery 104.5. Yeah, we'll select this one 108. Take this power supply and rotate this power supply. Positive is connected to collector 
whereas ground is connected to negative of this. I will take one more ground for that go to net port, go to ground and place it. Make the connection of it. Yeah, we are done with the schematic. This is the schematic of RC coupled amplifier. Now I will convert this schematic into layout for that go to file and click on convert to PCB. Click on convert to PCB. Once I click it I convert to PCB. Click OK. Here we can see that this is the layout or the patterns of each components. Now we will arrange this registers as well as capacitor accordingly. We also have this battery. Since its size is bigger, as I shown in the previous video, I will change its the size of this pattern. Just right click on this and go to ungroup. Once we click on the ungroup, click on ungroup components, delete this box. and I will arrange this as accordingly. Now I am in the top layer, I am going to draw a box around it. Yes, once we draw the box, press escape and select this component, right click on it, once again click on group. Then it acts as a symbol, a one symbol. Now it's time to draw the layout. For that, I have to arrange this now I will draw the layout. In order to draw the layout, first we can see that here the thin line it is known as the thin blue line is known as a rat line. Wherever the rat line is present, there we have to draw the trace. In order to draw the trace, we have to select the route manual. Click on route manual and click on OK. Here the segment width, we can select segment width as a 1.5 mm or 2 mm accordingly. Now I will draw the trace wherever the rat line is present there I will draw the traces. This I am drawing these traces from here from input capacitor. One thing you should remember that the angle of the trace should be 45 degree it should not be 90 degree. We should choose the shortest path. Avoid the long tracks. You can make the connection from transistor to resistor here. Now we can see that this wire is overlapping. This wire is overlapping. Let's see how we can avoid this. We are left with one more connection here and that is we can draw it. It is between transistor and resistor. Since the tr same track is connected, we can draw from here.
yeah we are done with the layout once we are done with the layout now we have to draw the border in order to draw the border just go to place border outline and draw the border okay one mistake we have done here the mistake is that we should have changed the layer as a bottom layer but we have drawn this traces in top layer now how to solve this problem just select all and right click on the track traces and change the segment or trace or layer as segment the segment layer to bottom once again i will do it select all go to top select all the segments go to bottom yeah now we can see that all the layer are going to appear in the bottom we have corrected that mistake now i will draw go to top i will draw the border just draw the border outline here just draw border outline yeah we are done with the border outline now come to bottom layer and it's now time to draw the copper pore just select go to place copper pore and i will draw along with the border we are drawing this copper pore here yeah here select solid go to connectivity this is the important one the we have to select the proper net which net we have to select here for that just go to schematic and see to which net the ground is connected just right click on this go to property here we can see that it is connected to net 1 now you go to layout select it as here as a net 1 click okay now we can see that we are done with the layout of the rc coupled amplifier in order to name this circuit go to top layer and here select the text and enter here write the name as rc amplifier rc amplifier and in order to take its print out now go to this review review here we can see that it is the top layer of the rc coupled amplifier but we have to take the print out of bottom layer go to bottom this is the bottom layer of the rc coupled amplifier once we take this its print out then we can fabricate the pcb using this layout thank you